What is happening, y'all? Welcome. I'm back to more Vigil. So I looked into it. Uh, I can respec. Apparently, it's much later in the game. There's an area, like, over here somewhere uh, up beyond the cemetery that I can respec at. So we'll just stick with our, our dual swords for now. And, you know, if it turns out that I really don't like them, then later on I'll just respec. That'll be that. So anyway, let's continue down this way. Why do I feel like we're about to come into a boss? Oh, this is definitely a boss fight. Oh, God. That is big. So it has, oh, it has a swipe and it has a reach. Oh my God, bro. That thing obliterated me. I didn't even get to really test what I wanted there. I felt like uh, I was getting more damage on the head, but I didn't get a a good chance to look. Because the, the number is kind of blended into her body. Take my thing. Where's my thing at? Isn't it, uh... Oh, God. No, wait. It spits stuff, too? Why am I not healing? Hang on. Oh. Because I have no heals. Okay. I might be fucked. Yeah, okay. So, on that hand drag back... So she reaches out. I need to dodge that and then roll in. We'll, we'll do one more try at this if I can't beat her. Um, I can go to the town as I got a... Uh, oh, seven. Yeah, I can, I can go buy healing potions from town if need be. But I want to see if I can do this. Just beat her outright. So I'm going to wait for that. Hoping to backstep it. Oh man, you know I I don't know. Maybe I don't want these things. I look at the other stuff. test this out. I'm probably better with these. Um, I don't know. What does enchant do? 
don't have any of that stuff anyway. Oh no, you're the storage one. I need the, um, where's the, the merchant to buy stuff? I was testing out the axe charge there, but it doesn't seem all that good. Um, right up here. Sacred Trail Inner, and we'll try this again. I think part of it is, like, I just, I don't know. I'm not used to playing fast, speedy weapons, so this is a, a very, very different approach for me. But we're, we're going all in. We're getting rid of our old save. Um, let me put on Altovs. Sold merchants, sold merchants, sold merchants. I wonder if I could dynamite to stagger the boss. Oh, God damn it. Oh god. Oh my god. Alright, you know what? Just 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 kill me. Can I just go back to my last save? Alright, so the Maltovs look like those could be pretty good. I think I um I think what I gotta do here is throw out a Maltov, burn the boss, and then dash in and start getting damage. I don't want to say like games too hard but maybe i shouldn't be playing on hard but some of these like dude some of these like kills like even bloodborne would be like damn bro i want to tone that down a little bit fuck it screw the molotovs Alright, so I'm getting my normal numbers. 28 and 8. 8, 8. What are these? Oh, no. Oh, these little, they spawn little things out. What the fuck? God damn it. Alright, so every time she screeches... Nope, too early there. Every time she screeches, that's when things are going to fall. A couple of people in the comments were like, no, don't, don't start the game on hard. Play it on normal first and then go to hard. And I was like, oh, 
And I play everything on hard. It can't be that bad, but yeah, some of these... I mean, as long as I can keep buying potions, you know, I just need to heal more. I'm imagining the bosses have more health. Oh, shit. I don't know why I thought I was safe all the way at the belly. skills for it, but I'm going to try it, because why not? I think it's the meteor thing. I need to just not do that. I mean, the DPS is there. Oh my god, the rocks, bro. Stop with the fallen rocks, lady. Redemption? Whoa, wait, was this was this Bruna? You now jump a second time in the air. You can now access areas previously inaccessible. My free, please, you must take this into the graveyard or more blood will flow. I hope my foolishness won't cause more tragedy. Tell me who did this to you. Oh, Graham. Oh, my beloved Graham. I hope you haven't done anything stupid. May the goddess guide you. Wait, was that the little girl that was missing? Bro, no! Oh, it's a different meaning for everyone. For you, it's very different indeed. Defeat the gatekeeper, pass through the port of Avernus, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, we've heard that before, weirdo. Percival's armor. Is it good? Hmm. Slightly less defense and poise, but 20 health. So I think my, my effective health... Maybe off. Oh no, but this has stamina. This has item drop. I do like item drop. We'll keep Percival's armor on for now. What was that? I didn't do that. I didn't get a I didn't get a level for that. I need to find a save. I wonder if it auto saves when you kill bosses. Or like if I die before 
No flowers in the cave, only blood. I want to make a flower crown for Chris. I hope Graham comes home soon. Weird child. So my aerial capabilities are a lot better than they were. Wait, isn't this the like the start of the zone? Yeah, it is. a thing I could use to get up higher that I could have uh something. Let's see what else is down here and where this goes. Just a healing potion. Okay. I don't think there was anything else. Let me try something here. It drops you straight down to the boss. Uh, so what's the load? If I load back to the boss, dude, I am so mega fucked. Oh no, there was this guy right here. Alright, so the only thing I'm, I'm missing... Oh, we want to, before I do anything else, I want to... So she got me the thing... Well, no, let me check this area out. She got me the thing uh, for that gate. another spin combo four hits after crescent spin the start of this attack is an evasion press heavy attack button after crescent spin grant 0.1 second evasion duration and hits deal harder damage right, so I think what it means is that attack I just did there I think it has iframes in it I also don't think it's worth going in that shit-ass cave just to get a one healing pot. It sure does not feel like I'm dodging when I do that. Small shimmer stone. 
And I'm out of healing, so... Part of me is like, maybe it's time to go back and find a... Teleport. Boy, throwing knives. That's, that's super helpful right now. Legends Blood Soul. So is there no... I guess you just come up here and... Get some loot, and that's it. And an angry bat that I can fight. Oh, oh god. Alright, just hang on a second. That's just a normal bat. It had, like, red eyes, so I thought maybe there was something special about that bat. So that doesn't look like there's anything there. There's... A path over there that I haven't really... Oh no, wait. Secret cave and secret trail. Okay, never mind. I did the cave. The cave is what I went all the way through. There's a couple areas that I didn't... Let me go back to the town. I know there was like chests and shit that I couldn't reach and... Now that I have double jump, I can, so... Teleport to main outskirts. And there's this church, which we'll do in a bit. But I want to get all that loot and obviously buy more health potions. It's where all my gold is going. Every freaking gold I have is like, oh, health potions? Yes, we need those. It was right here in the supply warehouse. Yes, it is. Shimmerstone. I don't wish I had some different weapons, like better dual blades. I don't know how far, like, the... My, my heart is like, upgrade those weapons. Use those weapons, upgrade them right now. But my mind is like, bro, you know you're going to get a new pair of dual blades pretty soon. You should definitely hold on to that resource. Save it for when the time comes. And I'm like, eh. But am I, though? And we've gone through two bosses, and I've only found, uh... Isn't there something in the Mukdar home, too? We've gone through two bosses, and so far I have one of each base weapon. One of the, which I had to purchase. There was... Oh, there we go. It's gold. Yeah, how did I do that? Did I walk? And I gotta see this again. I feel like I wall jumped. I guess I just jumped and I grabbed it. home. I think his was like a two-story with some shit. Let me go just check at the blacksmith. I'll just, I'll just take a look. Just see how much upgrade I'd get. have stuff to uh, consumables arcane forge weapons armor rings package so package is everything I wish there was a description for like this is all shit you can sell not a description but you know like a category of like stuff you will sell I don't even remember picking that up. I give her that. Uh, I'm gonna sell that. 
probably gonna sell most of my shit that I'm not using, to be honest. I think it's worth keeping the bow just to like, you know, ping something from far away and drag it over. Four fifty. One twenty. It's gotta be a quest item. The fact that it's worth one definitely a quest item. Um, didn't I have one other thing to sell? The boots. The old boots. Okay. Forge. Adds to... Uh, oh, I guess. Yeah, screw it. I've only got to use one to upgrade it. I mean, I might as well, you know, like, who knows how long I'll use these for. Um, secret trail, inner valley, main bridge. Let's go to the outskirts. Double-headed axe look dope. to the blacksmith plus three weapon start of the game I'm mean, gonna be honest I, I completely forgot to uh, to buy healing potions while I was here anyway so all right now I'm up to triangular so all right I don't feel that bad about saving them if I found three already screw it I'm sure I'll find three more uh, so we're gonna buy potions and then I think we're actually I uh, might as well just wrap up here because I need potions obviously so let me buy some potions, we'll head on out, and in the next episode we will continue from the church area. I think that's going to be the, uh, the plan. Wait a minute. So let me see something. Because I bought 20 before. And I'm really hoping I'm wrong here, but I think... Potions and storage might not go into your inventory. I think I need to come. Oh, man. Yeah, that's fucking tedious. Well, there's 20 there. I can come back and get them. Just sucks that I need to every time. Wait, why am I going mountain pass? I wanted to go the, the main outskirts. Uh, but yeah, that kind of sucks. Every time I want potions, I'm going to have to to go back over to her. So anyway, we'll wrap this one on up. I'm going to head on over to the place and we'll continue on from the cemetery in the next episode.